Hey there, fellow car enthusiasts! It's great to be back with another episode of fixing more rigor car add-on issues in Blender. So buckle up and get ready to dive into some serious 3D modeling with me! First off, let's deal with the brake calipers spinning with the wheel. It's as simple as parenting the calipers to the rotors and making sure the rotor is the main. Then, after this, we add an object constraint called Limit Rotation. We don't want the X axis to spin, so click that box. Now do this for the other three wheels. So you're all smug and happy, and you're going to press that generate button and... Oh no! Widgets are all wonky! That's not a problem. All you need to do is click the layer so that we can edit it here. Then go into object mode and select the widget affected. Go into the edit mode and adjust it from here. With this, we can correct the three ground base widgets that seem to be off on mine. And I also moved the suspension into a more satisfying position. It's just for looks. The model still works regardless. Next! Use a follow path to plot a route. Add resolution to the curve, 64 maybe. Put an object constraint onto the car rig. Use the NURBS path for the target, and now click Animate Path, and check it's worked. We Sand. Now, add some drivers to the wheels. Type in hashtag frames times two into the X axis. Now copy and paste this into all the other wheels. Now your wheels rotate. The rotate auto function will work here, but because we're on a path, they won't rotate. Think of it as a car on a tow truck trailer. Yes, the car's moving, but the wheels obviously aren't. To make them rotate with the auto feature, we would need to unparent from the curve and manually move the car across the scene, yeah? Then it would be driving around, not being towed. With this in mind, we're not going to be baking our wheels as we're using drivers. We're going to manually tweak the car at the peaked points, say the drift mid corner, the roll, and the steering. The steering only takes three keyframes per corner. Don't be afraid to manually do it. If you're on Blender 3.4, this is how I've had to learn how to do it. I think there's a bug and it, they don't work. But basically, I'm not offering the solution. I'm, it's more of a workaround. If you learn how it works manually first, you understand what to do when the auto features break. Yeah. Render it out. Easy. And there we have it. I'm working on more tips for rig car, so subscribe for more. Bye bye. Sand.